the great Lenten traditions of our church is praying together the stations of the cross. And when I teach our second grade children on their church tour about how they know they are in a Catholic church, one of those marks is the stations of the cross. Every Catholic church embraces this devotion, not just during Lent, but every day, because it reminds us of the depth of Christ's love for each of us and the incredible suffering that he endured. But as we walk these stations during Lent, each one of them has a story to tell each one of us. These are stories about judgment and malice. They're stories about hate and evil. They're stories about people taking risks for the sake of the good. They're about sadness and tragedy. They're about everyday life experiences we have. Christ walked them for us. And as he walked them, he showed us great faith. He showed us great strength. He showed us great perseverance. As we walk them in our everyday lives, we too must witness to this world of the power of our faith, of the strength that comes to us through the grace of Christ, and of our willingness to persevere even in the most difficult and challenging times. And so I encourage you to make return to this great Lenten devotion. Pray with us these 14 stations that not only represent the great sufferings of Christ, but represent the lives that we are asked to live every day in faith. May this land continue to be a great source of grace and hope for each of us.